Welcome everybody to another episode of City Skylines with me, Iflux, doing an unmodded series and um, I have to apologize to someone and that someone is uh, known by the nickname of Wonderful Art and it's basically my main faithful viewer, <laughs> at least participates in the comments and I don't want he or she to feel like I'm ignoring the comments, okay, wonderful art, I'm not ignoring. When I add something to the to-do to list, eventually I get to it, but I still feel bad. So what I want to do is to take uh, the suggestion gave, given by uh, wonderful art and get rid of this pollution. These don't pollute at all, which I didn't know actually which is why I wasn't really too concerned about it, because I thought they weren't polluting, but they are. Look, these pollute and these don't pollute at all. I didn't know that. So let's take care of this immediately. Oh no. Okay, you guys are on it, right? One of these episodes, and again, another thing for the to-do list, I need to create uh, a few lakes. Yes, I know the nightmare we had a few episodes back with lakes, but I, ne I really need to figure out how to make lakes so I can spread a few lakes across the city and put some helicopter... what are they called? Helicopter depot uh, so they can quickly tackle these fires yeah, this will be under control this one okay, back to this thing I think this looks much better. First we got rid of the pollution, which is always a bonus, and then I moved the water pumps from here to here because I reckon we, when we build the iron ore industry here, we will need to expand a bit to, towards this area if I remember correctly, yeah. So I don't want to put these buildings here because I want to put the um, or industry buildings there and I put a path here because I think it looks good like for people that need to come in and, and maintain these things they have a path that's kind of what I was going for and soon enough we will need to move this because uh, this doesn't have enough space for what I want to do and soon we need to expand um, what is this called the water treatment plant I might try to expand towards this direction, maybe. Maybe. But I don't know, because here I want to put a iron ore industry, so... If it doesn't conflict with the industry, it will be okay. Whoa, 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 whoa. What's happening? It's because I moved the water pumps, now the water is going crazy a bit. Oh, God. Oh, God. I need to... <laughs> I need to create um, the the quays around here. Yeah. Well, they'll survive. I think the water will adjust and go back to normal. It was just because of the water pumps, I think, that uh, created this mini tsunami. But it will get back to normal pretty soon. I hope. So what do I want to do this episode? 
well first you see I wanted to make sure that uh, one of my viewers wonderful art is happy with this okay I did not forget I did not forget <laughs> and um, and yeah it's true this needed a bit of, of tweaking and hopefully it's better now and what I wanted to do whoa what fancy buildings are these Ooh, superb strategy games uh-huh well they upgraded all the, these don't fit here too much yeah I don't want these tall buildings here do I oh look so cool the blimp there <sighs> look at the blimp look at this um, skyline so cool trains going around and people and blimps and more trains here and cargo trains there <laughs> so cool but I don't think these tall buildings fit this team actually I need to move this around uh, sorry guys I need to unzone you Okay, this is not going particularly well. I should have built the quay before I built the buildings. Oh my god. And I'm flooding my own city. <laughs> okay. My own city, I mean the, the main part of the city. Alright. So the water still... Does it still overlap? No, I think now it's good. And now seems a bit better but this curve here yeah this is a quite tight curve and this looks a bit weird nothing new it's my city I'll be surprised if it didn't look weird but why do you why are you 
so low. It should be a bit high. Okay, I need to, to fix this because water is trapped here. This quay is too... L it's like it... This should be completely flat. Why isn't this completely flat? Okay. I need to kind of destroy most of this area. I don't have any public transports here, right? That would make things a bit... No. Okay. So I'm going to destroy a bit of this and I'm going to try to make a proper shoreline. Yeah. So that the water doesn't flood both sides. So yeah, I need I need to take care of this. So this episode first was to put a bit of more clean space here, uh, clean water here. And now I need to address the, the shores of the river to make sure they don't flood the city. Yeah, I'll be right back. Okay, this should have fixed it, hopefully. And I also took this opportunity to put the path that I wanted right next to the shoreline. It looks really cool. And let's see if the water is going to behave. This is a bit low. Oh, wow, look at this VIP. Look at these VIPs right here. Hey dog, what's happening? <laughs> oh, he's a bit... It's a wigging the tail. Dog, what are you doing, dog? You're tickling your human's face with your tail, are you? Now you're... Uh, I, I don't want to know what's going on here. But uh, it is quite a VIP. Area. Look at this. Look at this view. You live in this building and then you come downstairs. You have some nice tables, some nice shade. You can enjoy the scenery. Very nice. Yeah, it doesn't look too bad, does it? Oof, it's going to flood. It's going to flood. Look at this wave here. Look at this wave. Yeah, okay, maybe it's just temporary while the river readjusts to the new geography. Yeah, let's give it some time to see if this stabilizes. Because every time you mess the shoreline, it the water takes a while to adjust. Actually seems not to be under control. It does kind of gain momentum. It gains momentum here, but then it cannot go over the quay, it seems. Oh no. 
Ah, I think this is trapped water. I think I saw some waves around here, yeah. Can I fix it by flattening here the terrain a bit? Oh no. Shit. Or I just don't touch this. It's a crazy idea, isn't it? Ugh. <laughs> it was good until I touched it. <laughs> <sighs> Me and water in this game. Everybody's sad. I know, guys. I know. I will figure this one out. Okay, citizens. Do not despair. Okay. I should, I should just not touch this area again. Or maybe... Yeah, look at this. Maybe I should make this the river smaller so it doesn't curve so much. Should I? Yeah, I th but then I need to destroy. Well, maybe I don't need to destroy all of this. I don't know, guys. I feel like if I touch this, it's good. But look, it looks weird. The water... Uh, maybe if I flatten the this part yeah oh crap what am i doing <laughs> i'm going to flood my city again <laughs> okay soften terrain let's soften it up yeah softly softly yeah, okay, it's kind of soft. Yeah, did I flood anything? Oh no. Okay, I think that improved things. The water seems to be flowing more towards the ocean than towards the size of the river. Oh, this curve here is weird. This is a weird curve. Yeah. I'm going to fix it guys, screw it. <laughs> if I mess this up, I mess this up. But this looks weird, the river, doesn't it? Uh, it needs to be a bit thinner around here. Yeah. Okay, I'm going to screw this a bit and I'll be right back. The water flow. Oh, <laughs> my God, what am I doing? What am I doing to my beautiful city? Oh, like this, I don't see the floods. <laughs> well, at least the streets are going to be clean. Oh, <laughs> poor people in the bus. Holy crap! <laughs> Oops, the the bus. Where did it go? Did it go to the ocean? Oh my god! <sighs> what a sadistic mayor that my citizens have. <laughs> Poor citizens. It's good. The streets will be cleaned. We have a much better shoreline and river, look at this. It's a clear improvement and, you know, progress as these things, sometimes progress um, causes problems. But it's almost clear now. Yeah, the trucks, uh, the pumping trucks should be here in a minute and clear this. Right? Oh, and now it's raining. <laughs> Wonderful. <laughs> That's really what you need after a flood, right? Oh, now there's a lake here. 
at the school. Why not? People still use the school, right? Yeah. Oh god. What have I done to my city? Oh 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 oh. Oh no, never mind. What is this? <laughs> My poor city. Oh well. It's progress. I think it's massive progress. So. This is a blessing in disguise, okay, guys? Okay, I'll, I'll leave this just for now. Because I think the best way to connect power is going to be through here. But not yet. Okay, I think. We still have a bit of flood thing around here, yeah, but the trucks, the pumping trucks are going to clear this, yep, yeah, it's done. Okay, we did cause a bit of mayhem, which we were expecting to cause anyway. And, um, yeah, I think I should continue this. I think I should continue this. Okay, let's do a bit of more queying. Queying around? Is it is it the word queying? Oh, I just realized I did a mistake. <sighs> Remember when I said I wanted to keep the outside industry isolated and that's why I created all of this, so then I have inside railroads and outside railroads. Yeah, I just connected the arbor directly to my inside Railroads. Am I having issues with this? I need I need to check these trains. No, it should be okay. Yeah, there's no. I think the passenger trains are the worst. It cause more problems than the cargo trains. I think. Yeah, this looks. Oh my god. Yeah, I need to come and revisit this. <laughs> <laughs> it's not too bad, but it, it it's bad. It's bad. Uh, okay. This doesn't look too bad, does it? This doesn't look too bad. Wow, the airplane. Soon we can build an airport. This area will start to look a bit more industrial looking when I put more uh, of those factory buildings and some more some more parking lots wow I'm really liking this city very cool okay the people want to move in after this wonderful river creation I can't blame them I would want to move in here wouldn't you? I think you would Okay, let's put some roads. I'm going to put some roads around here and I'll be right back. We don't have demand for anything at all, <laughs> but um, yeah, I think the shoreline is better. I might come at some point and tweak it a little bit, and I might want to do ferries at some point, 
like to connect from here to here around this area and then to between both margins of the river <sighs> yeah people are dying I can't understand why they would die okay let's build here a few roads shall we some curved roads yeah following kind of the pathway and then okay I think this is not too bad I need to put straight roads okay yeah this doesn't look too bad now let's put some connections from here okay doesn't look too bad we just need to give a bit of time to the city to readjust to all these changes oh, this looks a bit weird uh, let's see if I can make it less weird Why are we losing so much money? What's going on? And right, now all of a sudden we're getting a lot of money. Okay. I don't know what happened there. Yeah. So many things to, that I want to do in this city. So many things. I think this was a productive episode. We fix the river or if we didn't fix we I think we improved it quite significantly we also improved these waterfront things look at these little houses nice so we improved things a bit and th yeah this is all part of our expansion because um, now that we have this done properly water won't flood these areas and we can actually develop them properly yeah doesn't look too bad I really like the way this city is uh, developing oh and before we finish I want to do something again because I feel guilty I want to label this city after my viewer I think he or she deserves it let's rename this to wonderful art uh, not sad face <laughs> ignore this okay this is my tribute to my my most faithful viewer so far or at least most active I should say and um, yeah, I hope you enjoyed it and uh, I'll see you again in the next episode. Bye.